Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. It's Melody, I'm so excited to vlog today because I'm celebrating my birthday with some friends. We're having people over at our house to make succulent arrangements and we're doing a little potluck. If you recall, we did a potluck over a year ago for Kaylee's 100 day celebration and I love the idea because people can bring their own favorite dishes. I'm going to capture as much as I can and I will share with you what we do. Before I continue on, make sure you subscribe if you're not already subscribed. I make lots of videos where I showcase special occasions, fun events, trips, and I also love to create mommy vlogs as well. So subscribe, and I would love your support on this channel. If you like these kinds of videos, give it a thumbs up. I love celebrating birthdays. I feel like it's a great way to get people together, and it's always an excuse for me to invite my friends over and to have a fun time. Without further ado, I will show you the spread that I set up before people eat it, and then I will vlog my birthday celebration. Here is the spread I put together. I was inspired by an Instagram account called Cheese Pretty Please. They make these amazing cheese charcuterie platters for events, and I believe they're in LA and Orange County. So I wanted to do something that was similar. It's not as pretty as theirs, but I still think it looks delicious. I kind of went with a succulent theme because we are making succulents at our party, and I did it in rainbow order. So I start here, I have pomegranates, red bell peppers, apples, some meats, carrots, cheese, and you come down here, some dried mangoes, cheese, yellow bell peppers, cauliflower, more cheese, and then here's more goodies back here with the dark grapes. This is a sugar plum jam on top of cheese. That's gonna be a delicious spread. More grapes. I just made these roasted walnuts in the oven with thyme and rosemary. Got some different crackers, chickpeas, dried chickpeas, and then celery, more crackers, kiwi, and I put them in a rainbow order to make this gorgeous spread. I also put together a few desserts. Because this is potluck style, I didn't put together too much food. I mean, I guess that is a lot, but I'm gonna have everyone bring some things to enjoy. And then since we're making succulents, I have this book here for inspiration and then a little succulent mug where people can grab their forks to enjoy their spread. We're still getting the rest of the house ready. We have a few kids coming, so I clean up Kaylee's play area. We still have things to set up outside. And check this out. Rodney put up these outdoor market lights tonight and they're nice and straight in a straight line. I was gonna just hang them in different directions, but he wanted them in a straight line. And here are all the supplies for a second we're making. I have tons of cuttings here. And I have different pots with soil. So this is going to be a fun activity. We'll see who wants to participate. But we're still getting ready. Kaylee's napping. Peter is trying to eat the food, but I told him that he couldn't eat it yet. And here is one more glimpse of the beautiful spread that I put together. All right, the outside is almost ready. I have a bunch of different pots, bigger ones and smaller ones people can choose, and they can make their arrangements with all the cuttings over there. I also have lots of my own succulents that I'll be taking cuttings from if people want those as well. All right, the party's getting started, and of course, it's the baby party. Uh, Kaylee is dressed to the nines. Basically, I have a lot of dresses for her, and I need occasions to wear them, so I put her in a cute dress, and we are playing with our neighbor, Maya. They're on the same age, and I think they're having a fun time together, starting the party. Oh, Kaylee, you're so curious. Who's here? Who's here? All right, the potluck has started. And we have all sorts of good things that are disappearing fast, including orange chicken, lemon chicken. Yeah, it's always a video. This buffalo chicken dip. And Kaylee is playing with Peter outside. So cute. Through the window. Okay, through the window. All right. This is an Instapot recipe for my neighbor Elizabeth, and it's so good. I'm not sure how to make it, but I'll have to learn how to make it. But yes, food is being eaten and everyone is enjoying. And of course, there's Haley. Any kisses for Peter. So is this her second Christmas? Yes, second Christmas. Oh, and then we got another little neighbor baby over here. So cute. Oh, okay. Kaylee, of course, is the life of the party from playing with all the babies. Do you live around here, too? In the couple? Yeah. The Melanski School is not my savings team. We need to be careful. Oh, no, Preston. We need to be careful. Yeah. They do a good job. Say hi, Kaylee. Oh, now that I'm filming, she's not interested. What? Down in the mission valley from, like, I love like, like, you want to share your phone? Yeah. Telephone. Yeah. Like, that was like, 
Yeah, so we're fun. Good sharing, Kaylee. Yeah. Good sharing. Yeah. Thank you, Kaylee. I think I told you guys I was having a succulent making party, so we're taking clippings from my own. See, this one was in my wedding. That's my wedding bouquet succulent. And we are making succulent arrangements. And Aaliyah is very creative, so I'm excited to see how hers turns out. She has her own watercolor yeah, design company. Right and she oh, so then he hired you? So he offended you and then he hired you? No, no, this is kind of hard to see. And I'm like, what? But yeah, there's Alex clipping uh, my succulents. Yeah. Oh, no, 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 no. This one is in the works. <laughs> she says Grace is in charge of the succulents, so. Yeah, Grace is in charge. And we even have this succulent book for inspiration. Where's Grace? Nathan. Grace is Nathan. I don't know if you know him, but this one. All right, here's one of the arrangements that's made. Made by Alex Jones. Alex is the masterpiece behind this one. Look at this. And yes, it's this big feather in the ground. Oh, Kaylee, you My excited about the... Time. You excited about the succulent? Ah, okay. She wants it. She's ready to get out and start playing. Are you going right, to fill the whole thing? Are you going to get the work? And this is really cool because there's a little pot and the big pot. And I want to show you the variety of everyone's succulent meat you know, here. Like all, pieces. all coming together. Spilling the pot and spilling water. <laughs> all right, the party is inside now because Rodney's showing off our massage chair. And it's being enjoyed. And Peter's still trying to get scraps as usual. Alright, here's the finished look at all of the succulents. They're all different. Mine just kind of just I used one. <laughs> and these mini ones. Check out this one that has the little fallen pot. I love that. And these mini ones with the pearls are pretty. And there's the cycle. Some people left already, so this is the people that are already here. And there's little Kaylee. Oh, you want to show off here? Alright okay, guys, everyone's gone. We cleaned up the whole entire house. As you can see, behind us is all clean. We got some beautiful flowers from my neighbor. And we made those beautiful succulent arrangements that you saw. I love having an interactive activity or creating something unique to do to celebrate my birthday, to bring together friends and to have some good food and great conversation. So every year I try to come up with something where it's a fun activity, not, nothing too serious that you can still have fun with. Again, last year we painted succulents. Um, these ones, this was mine that I painted last year. And this one was Rodney. So this year I thought we would make succulent arrangements because I have so many that are overflowing and I wanted to share them. And succulents are really abundant. They grow and grow and grow. You don't have to do anything to them really and they keep growing. So I am a huge into zero waste. You saw that huge platter that I made. I'm gonna show you what I did, did with some of it. Take you over to the kitchen. I didn't want to throw away all those fruits and veggies. It didn't get eaten. A lot of it did, but still a lot of it did not. So I threw it in the blender, my Vitamix, and I turned them into smoothies that I'll be enjoying for breakfast tomorrow. And let's see. Oh, and I also made little smoothie pouches for Kaylee. She loves smoothies. There's tons of fruits and veggies in it, so she'll get to enjoy some smoothie pouches for tomorrow as well. So that's it. Thank you guys for watching. I uh, had a fun celebration for my birthday. We made some cool succulents, got to catch up with people. And again, I love creating an experience for people to be able to come together. And it really, it's an excuse for me to get together with people to celebrate my day that I was born. So thank you so much. This is Melody signing off. I hope you will come back next time. Before you leave though, Give this video a thumbs up if you like videos like this and if you like to celebrate your birthday as well. And make sure you hit that subscribe button so you can see more content like this. All right, guys, thank you so much. Have a good night. Bye-bye.